This morning, much of the south is bracing for snow from a powerful storm system blamed for at least three deaths after bringing blizzard conditions to parts of the Midwest. CBS News correspondent Whit Johnson watching the storm now in Charlotte, North Carolina for us this morning. Whit, good morning. Chris, good morning to you. Well, this massive storm as it moved east, it ran head on into some warmer temperatures in places like here in North Carolina, Charlotte anyway, really dodged a bullet. The same cannot be said, however, for parts of the country's midsection. Many were still digging out after the last big storm in the Central Plains before this storm dropped another two feet. In Texas, rainy roads turned slick after temperatures dropped as much as 30 degrees in just a matter of hours. And it's not over yet. Parts of Mississippi, North Carolina could get up to five inches of snow when it's all said and done. Atlanta is expecting only an inch of snow, but that can still cause huge disruptions in a city with just eight snow plows. And take a look at some of this video. Driving was especially treacherous in Arkansas. This stretch of roadway saw literally dozens of accidents as cars and trucks slid downhill into one another. Thankfully, nobody was seriously hurt, but a lot of sheet metal took plenty of damage. And as we've seen with all these storms so far this winter, there were hundreds of delayed or canceled flights. Hard hit Dallas, Houston, Memphis. Those were some of the worst areas in just a winter that just keeps on going. And February has just begun. Chris, back to you. With thank you. I'll tell you, you see those pictures. And if you've been in any type of fender bender, just that sound of contact. Uh, all right, Whit, thanks so much. That's Whit Johnson yeah. for us in Charlotte for us this morning.